Welcome back. CTF Fire Lab, ladies and gents. Just on a echo, but Matt, you just brought up a really good point. Fear versus phase. Yes, uh, brought on right this now. one up. This is a, another match that would the winner will be uh, you know, guaranteed top four. Not a spot in the relegation tournament. Right, because I top, asked you this in the break. Top three move on. I imagine the only way that they can really do that is a consolation match between the two losers in the semifinals. So that would make sense. Right. So uh, face currently down at this first hard point. Uh, we keep tabs on that. If this CTF drags out a little bit, we can always switch over. Yeah. Uh, one out. Already though. In favor of our red teams, give me stunner. Flag in the hands of Young Miyagi. Making his way down, Snow caps this is going to level up the game, and honestly, it's looking good. Uh, he's Taking play his time a little bit passively, yeah, I was about to say, but it doesn't matter. It is going to run that one home. He's be careful though, because he has zero control over green, and that is exactly where Stunner are pushing Miyagi. Drops, and the push comes in now from Stunner, looking at TCM to control this mid bio lab area as his teammates try and run the flag. Right now, doing really? a very nice job of watching his back. Looks like he's going to be. Pretty clear to go. He's going to have actually one player to beat. Oh, and that geez. player is not going to even challenge right there. Very nice run by Perplex. I think the player <laughs> on uh, on Echo just completely lost. That was Mutation right there. Just took the complete wrong route. Missed the Saint. The flag. GCM looks like he's going to go for the challenge. Jumps up top. Trying to figure out where Saint is. Saint's still over there. And, oh, I thought it was Saint that killed him. No, that he got shot in the side. Ridiculous. Yeah, I was going to say. That would have been absolutely bonkers, but... Mutation ultimately with the kill. Gucci, who's had a pretty awful series, just gonna be honest and say it. Uh, yes. Definitely picked things up in the SD though. Gotta give him props for that. But really, eyes on him uh, to really have a good game right now. Uh, he's stunned outside of snow. Not like the route that he took, but still able to put that one in. You can see though why Biolab is such a hectic map that now, as soon as he's able to pull that one, it looks like we're going to get a counter on the opposite side. It's going to be Perplex trying to run that flag, but he is actually stopped by a player over on Green Street. So very nice plays from both teams coming in here. Tie game, two minutes to go. But over in this phase game, they're down by a uh, no con pretty phase? considerable margin. Yeah. Wow. That's very surprising. Uh, Fear playing with a different lineup than they played with in that first qualifier. Remember when uh, we were watching them with? and they were not playing with the lineup that they qualified for champs with? Now today they're playing with their champs qualifier lineup. So much different Fear. So I feel like that's worked out better than they didn't qualify the first time. Right. In a weird way. Because now they can try and build that solid roster of the, the four. Mm -hmm. Weird. But hmm. I wonder what they would have done if they qualified day one. Very interesting. You might be able to. There are a, a few different. Trades? There are a few different windows. Uh, you can switch. Yeah, there are a few different windows right. that you can move players around. So they probably would have been able to do oh, something. Okay. That makes sense. That makes sense. Uh, meanwhile, TCM pushing the opposition flag here. Is going to go for the flag ball. Pretty ballsy move, and he is going to fall. Perplex and Vexy Group both picking up kills. Uh, speaking of Perplex, he is going to try and run this flag. Has a player stunned. Double jumping backwards, and that, that's a pipe. You can't run through that, but turns around, picks up the kill, and now is off. Actually shooting the canister in front. And that made zero sense. Matt, can you explain that to me? He shoots the left can sorry, he shoots the right canister, doesn't shoot the left canister, runs, and Miyagi just shoots the canister, he didn't shoot. That made absolutely no sense. Uh, that just was a really okay. bad play. Uh, I'm glad that isn't just me that was kind of confused about, by yeah, that. Yeah, that was awful. All right, Flex. Once again, trying to pull the flag. Last 30 seconds of round one. Already seen four captures. Can we see the fifth at the half? Of course, flag is going to be counterpulled. It's going to be Saint trying to run away with it. And he is not going to be able to get around the corner. And this is where Stunner now needs to react. Someone needs to get that return. But Flex needs to get the caps. Return goes in. Capture goes in as well with 10 seconds. Nice place from Stunner. The one flag lead down. Very nice place from Stunner. Close out that first half of CTF uh, going up one. Very nice plays out of Perplex, you know, just the entire whole game of the CTF, I believe he finishes 10 and 11, but still just an overall solid game from him. And you now over in this phase game, Ben, 111 to 86 in favor of Fear. So Fear putting up a very strong fight here against FaZe. Trying to go take a look at that one? Uh, let it sit a minute. Let it go back to that first hell, see what goes on. All right, stay with this one. Yeah. Go a little bit. Uh, three, two, plus in favor of Stutter. Uh, and uh, we talked about looking out for Gucci. Eight and 15, the struggle mat is continuing. 
Right, I think if he were playing much better, I think this team would, uh, you know, be putting up a much better fight. But also, you can't really single out Gucci. You gotta look over to the other teammates as well. Miyagi's struggling here, and Saint, you know, before uh, we talked about that, Saint was at nine kills as well. So, everybody positive, uh, minus perplex for Stunner, and then everybody on the Echo side not positive at all. So, that's really where we're seeing the difference in the game. Actually, Mutation, uh, he's only died nine times playing very slow. Looking at Vex to try and run this flag. Both flags away from base. Mutation with one on the other side of the map. He's going to be highlighted in yellow. But Vex immediately recognizes his teammates don't have control of red, so he's going to have to play this one a little slower. TCM picks up one. Someone actually managed to get all the way through. Vex has to turn around and get that kill. Perplex actually falling off the map, though. So, um... Seen a bunch of odd plays out of Perplex. Now, the blowing up of the canisters and falling off the map uh, had a has had a pretty good game, but still struggling a little bit. Nobody near mutation, but there's one player making a play on the opposing team's flag. And actually, mutation's gonna drop. Let's see. It's gonna be Saint trying oh, to pick up this Saint. one player, and he does. Very nice play. Gonna try and return that flag, and he gets it, but both flags go back to play. base. That was a really nice play from Saint. Yeah. You know, he's kind of pinned in. Two players watching each other's backs, plus flag in a horrible position. It's not exactly easy to return. The flag from, from up there, yeah, you know, players can spawn in and shoot you as you try and get that double jump, but Saint making it look easy. Now trying to cap this flag, pre-firing down ice, no one home, but he's going to have one gunfight, needs to be careful. And he's actually running back towards the stunner spawn at this point, and he's surrounded by stunner players. His teammates need to help him out here. Yes, they need to get over by him. He's going to try and challenge really one player, extremely player. risky. TCM looks like he's going to have one player to beat on his own flag. I believe he stunned him, so they should be able to pinch, and it looks like they're going to do so. He needs to get that flag in right away, though. This is a huge score right here for Stunner. I'm really surprised Saint didn't actually wrap that flag around back purple rather than going back towards snow. Essentially, just running towards the enemy spawn. Yeah. I, I don't understand that in CTF. You always want to bring it towards your, your team. teammates. And yeah. uh, right there, just not an example That's of that. Rule number one, stay by your team. Four to two, though. As uh, this one looking more and more like it could be over, and suddenly go 2 1 up in the series. Vex on the screen, pushing through mid purple. Looking for the first kill, connects with the first. TCM is swapping up one. Vex looks outside, there's the second. Nicely played, and flag pulled as well. It's going to be TCM making his way. Winning a huge fight green. on Gucci. Yeah, uh, Gucci really. No struggle in a bit still. 11 and 23. No huge gunfights win by TCM in the base. Looks like they're able to pick him up, but not able to get that flag return as we're going to see Vex pick it up. But here we go, another stalemate. This is big for Stunner. If they can just hold the flag, and they will be all good. Teammate wins. That was a big win right there. Oh, huge. Uh, they came in in that, in that kill feed. Um, this one's over, I think. A 5-3, uh, 5-2 with a minute 40 to go. I pretty much kind of chalked that one up as a win. Over in the phase versus Fear Holy game. moly. Fear currently up 2-3. 30 to 147, hard point Detroit going down that second to last hill. See if they can get this stop right here, then we'll throw it straight to that game. But it looks like they're gonna have a cap go in. So still only a two score game, pretty close. We'll stay on board with this one. You know, props to Gucci, can't really kill anything this game it seems, but managed to get those two caps trying to keep his team alive. Flag's gonna be full once again this time. It's gonna be Brian Saint. He's gonna drop these Gucci last man alive. You do not want to see Gucci go for the flag ball. Uh, he's actually going to die anyway, so it doesn't really matter. Last minute. Can we see two flags, Matt? No, don't think we can see two flags in a minute. It's going to be very difficult, especially, you know, Perplex making a very nice attempt to run this. And his teammate wins that battle in mid-bio. That was absolutely huge. They're going to have to rotate ah, back, though, over. and get their own flag. Let's see if Perplex can put this in. Wins that gun battle. That's actually Vax going to help him out. That is huge. One player on the flag, he's able to take him out. Very nice run. Ron, we can go to this other game, but looks like this one's going to be over as well. As you're going to see Stunner, they're going to win that one to go up 2-1 to one in the series. And right here, now let's get a listen in with FaZe. See what's going wrong with them in this hard point. Uh, just ran through Freeman Iron, dude. Don't even worry about that map. Just forget about it, dude. I got so much to break. I came onto those like clutch. We didn't challenge hill enough, and we didn't play spawns enough. That's all it came down to. I saw people flooding back alley to green hill, and I saw people flooding front school from ramp hill.
Never had spawns the entire game. So you had uh, 39 from Steady, steady recovery. right? Mm -hmm. yep. And then uh, you had uh, 31, I believe that was from Proof. Sense of uh, bringing up an interesting point now about not controlling the spawns. Uh, and that's something that I feel, you know, you need to be working together in communication. After they seem pretty quiet towards the end of that game, you've brought that up yeah. numerous amount of times. You know, you need to be communicating on point. This is a big, big kind of online I mean, tournament. You it, can't if afford to mess up to, If Fear were to beat Face Black, that dude, would throw... An, dude, that's an upset. That right. would throw everything for a yeah. loop. Uh, just, I mean, then you have, you know, all the teams everybody thought were the strong ones coming in would just be pretty much right. gone already. So... Uh, when we come back from this quick commercial break, we'll be bringing you game number four between Stunner and Echo, and also we'll be checking in on game number two between Phase and Fear.